I'm Emma Smith, season three, champion. I'm gonna try to win this mirror ball for the second time. <laughs> well, how you been doing? I'm great. You know, I'm still here. Obviously. <laughs> but we, I haven't won since you, so, you know, you're well, my lucky charm, I think. cha cha what? Good. I feel extremely lucky that I have Cheryl and that we are partners again. You got your championship before, right? Don't fix what's not broke. I can't touch this. <laughs> Hold and really go down there and groove. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, then. My wife loved to see me do the cha-cha because of the hip action. <laughs> I'm trying to impress right out of the gate. And this cha-cha is going to knock you out of your seat. All right, all right, all right. Dancing the cha-cha-cha. Emmett Smith and his partner Cheryl Burke. Chain, chain, chain. of the evening and the best. Top score of the night. Woo! This dancing, man, might be worse than football. Might. <laughs> I think we just we got nervous because we were going last. Yeah, we, we had to see everyone else dance, and they were all so good. Yeah, they really were. They were awesome. But with that said, I'm not necessarily intimidated by any of them. I mean, why would I get intimidated by an actor or Indy racer or speed skater. <laughs> Keep your head straight. It's a little crooked. That's natural. Wait, wait, wait. That's football. You're, right, your head is actually crooked. Yes, football. <laughs> I've been hit over 4,000 times. That's just in the pros. Gotta suffer for your, for your sport, like you did. That's why your head's crooked. <laughs> Slow, slow. When I look at Jill and I look at Drew and I look at everybody else, their head can go anywhere they want to go. They can look all cute and everything else. But for me, hey, I got to work with what I have. If you had to turn your head this way, it'd be a problem. But the fact that it's already veered over to this direction is helping you out. God has a great sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs> Dancing the quick step, Emmett Smith and his partner Cheryl Burke. The cool cat in town. The cool cat sits late at night while the dogs are sleeping. She's leaving the cave and the waves are gaining. Dance all night while the temperature's rising. She steps in the club and the walls are burning. There's a cool cat in town.
kill it. There's a cool cat in town. Oh, yeah, baby. Everyone at their game, and I feel like you kind of stayed where you were last week. We got a 22.5. Not the best score, but hey, it's not the worst score either. 22 is my number, baby. 0.5 is not. <laughs> Go on, Emmett. Take creative control here. This is all you. You're tripping. <laughs> Cheryl and I are doing a pasta doble that Karina and Mario did during season three. And I want to hear your feet. You got to teach me that move. <laughs> By being an artistic director, I can add my own little touch. The light in itself could be almost like dust. Just to set the mood and the theme and to give it that, that old desert feel. Five, six. Leon said he's looking for something that he's never seen before, which is going to be very hard for us to do. I got a great idea. Okay, what? All right, as we spin out of this, uh -huh. you go to that direction. Right. I go back this direction. Okay. And I take off running. Okay. As fast as I can. Okay. You split your leg. Okay. And I slide between. All I want is your legs to get through. I don't oh, want your I, whole body to get through. I, I get through. Oh, that sounded like it hurt. <laughs> Emmett basically charges at me from the other end of the ballroom, which is kind of scary because one misstep, <laughs> I'm going down with him. <laughs> oh. That's what can't happen. Dancing the Paso Doble, Emmett Smith and his partner Cheryl Burke. Torpedo man. Valero. I have Valero. Emmett and Cheryl get Valero. Valero. Is it from here? Valero's not in the Latin five dances I was trained in, so. I've seen Valero, it's beautiful. I just hope I can teach it. Back in Dallas, time to get to start on rehearsal. Trying to make it happen again for another week. Don't do that with your head, just keep it back. Okay. I have limited knowledge of what the bolero is about, and I need some help. So I brought in Sergey, Michelle, and Arkady and Natasha to help us so that you can really shine this week. <laughs> like a whole freaking clan in here. And you're gonna wind her up and knock her out. All of them see things differently, but yet they all really wanna help, and I appreciate that. But sometimes it can be too much information at one time. Freaking Bolero, it's giving me a headache. In, head back. Paolo, Jill, Sabrina, they are all like nice little smooth running Cadillacs. I'm like a Ford F-150. <laughs> trying to be elegant, trying to be stylish. They have a lot of edge on me, but at the end of the day, I know one thing. I will work hard and I'm gonna give it my best shot and I'm gonna hope that we can go out and perform like we're capable of performing. Daddy, when you perform, you need a smile. 
Dancing Bolero, Emmett Smith and his partner Cheryl Burke. Sexy beast. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Guilty pleasures week. If you guys make it through, what song are you going to be dancing to? This may surprise a lot of people, but uh, I'm going to dance to uh, the Copa Cabana by Barry Miller. At the Copa, Copa Cabana. Seven, eight. One, two. Oh, yeah. There we go. One. Two. Samba is a technically difficult dance because of all the different time changes and that samba bounce that you need. Seven and eight and six, seven, eight, a oh, one. Hey, you need more than that. Way more, yeah. When the last time we laughed, Cheryl? An hour ago. No. Like an hour ago. No. Yeah. It's been about two and a half, three hours. Our strategy in practice when things get too intense <laughs> is to try to find a way to laugh. <laughs> The samba is a party dance, so when Emmett really has fun and lightens up, he really captures the spirit of what this dance is all about. Good, ready? Calm down. <laughs> down. Dancing the samba, Emmett Smith and his partner Cheryl Burke. and you deliver maximum pleasure.
This is a really slow song. And one, two, three. Four. Cheryl and I are doing a foxtrot this week to Alice in the Stream by Dolly Parton and Kenny Rogers. You're dancing by yourself for 20 seconds. In this routine? This slow ass night? What the front door is going on? <laughs> I've never had a solo by myself. And so I was completely thrown off, especially the country. <laughs> I'll be honest, maybe something else. I can slow rock it, but country? Wow, wow. <laughs> Why are you laughing at me? I mean, you put this thing together. Why are you laughing at me? Because it's cute. <laughs> but you're still out of time to music. <laughs> That's even more funny. It's, yeah, it's funny. <laughs> Come on, E. Let's get a good one. The show right now is at midpoint, and everybody is fatigued. Everybody is tired. <sighs> what I learned early in my years of playing football. If you can't play with pain, you cannot play the game. And that's what it's oh. like being on this show right now. Mind over matter. If you don't mind, it don't matter. Being able to persevere through all the aches and pains and through all the fatigue and get the energy to continue to perform at a level that you're capable of performing. Ah. That's what I'm trying to do. Do it again. Right now, it's a matter of Survivor the fittest. <laughs>a bit of finesse here and there, but it was such entertainment and great to watch. Oh, well. So last week, our Foxtrot did not score great. It wasn't that bad. Well, there's been missteps. Now that we're coming into week seven of the competition, we can't do that anymore. And I think the only way to do that is to make sure that you really know the routine. Right. Six, seven, eight. Fire fusion dance, two, we're doing a samba rumba. You think that learning one dance is difficult. How about combining two dances? And two, no. It's not a samba step, it's a rumba step. And right over here, you have to look at me because it's rumba, remember? So rumba is like a romantic dance. So, <laughs> I know you're still thinking. What you about sister though? I know. <laughs> <laughs> To go from one dance to the other, it's really difficult for Emma, especially because I'm switching the dance every 10 seconds, so we're literally intertwining both dances. Rumba timing, two, three, four, one, two, one, a two. Hold on, did, did you say a one, a uh, one again, or a one, a two? The counts can just drive you insane. Two, three, and four, you're late. This week is getting a little bit more stressful. It's always a 
a pleasure to come back home and see my family and be around them just to relax a little bit, to take a little bit of the edge off. Uh oh, they're calling you down. They are truly my number one supporters. So going back and forth from LA to Dallas, it's all worth it. So I could be home, my most important dates for my kids. It's gonna be hard to combine the fusion with two dances. It's hard to dance, period. I'm talking about combining. That makes it tougher. But you getting it? I'm gonna get it. Without the support of my family, I couldn't be here. And so uh, hopefully we can pull this thing off and get 30s and uh, make my family proud. Dancing a rumba, samba fusion. Emmett Smith and his partner Cheryl Burke. <laughs> oh. yeah. You're not the type, type of girl to remain with the guy, with the guy too shy, too afraid to say he'll give his heart to you forever. I'm not the boy that would fall to his knees with his hands clapped tight, begging, begging you, please to stay with him for worse, for better. But I'm staring at you now there's no one else around i'm thinking you're the girl for me i'm just saying it's fine by me if you never leave and we can live like this forever it's fine by me in the past i would try try hard to commit to a girl wouldn't get too far it always somehow seemed to fall to me was your upper body. I kind of felt like you were in your head a little, like thinking about going back and forth between the two different sets. At the Viennese Waltz, we have to work on like what Carrie Ann said about working your upper body and your posture. Move one, move one as I'm spinning. You can't just be standing there. Knowing where we are right now in the show, knowing that there's a double elimination, it's very critical that I excel right now at this particular time. Hey, congratulations on making it to week eight. Thank you, man. It's nice to touch base with an old friend of mine who knows my competitive spirit for some words of wisdom and advice. I mean, I go back to when you walked into the rookie year and said, I want to be the NFL's all-time leading rusher when I retire, and I'm like, <laughs> wow. When you decide you want something, you're very difficult to stop. So, I mean, just keep tapping into that. It was great seeing Daryl again. He gave me some insight on the things that I went through as a competitor and reminded me that I must rise up and meet the challenge. Nothing better than making history, right? Somebody got to do it. Why not me? <laughs> Dancing the Viennese Waltz, Emmett Smith and his partner Cheryl Burke. Hello! Hello! 
I chose Kim Johnson for our salsa dance trio because I really wanted to showcase Emmett and show people that he's leading two girls. I think that's the hardest part. Three, seven, one, two. This is all messed up here. Got to turn. Mm -hmm. it's like he's stirring a pot. Well, Emmett's got Cheryl and myself telling him what to do. I kind of feel sorry for him, but I think he likes it. Turn us, turn us. No, no, Emmett, I can't do it like that. Dance with two women it can be complicated because, you know, that's four arms, two heads, two bodies four legs, run around. <laughs> I mean, I had to figure out how all this stuff is gonna come together. Trying to please two women, it's oh. tricky. Very tricky. <laughs> Fun challenge, though. Obviously, a man trying to give a woman what she needs and what she wants. That's really what I'm trying to do. <laughs> it's a lot of work for Emmett, but if we can pull this salsa off, it is going to blow everyone away. Go! Dancing the Salsa, Emmett Smith and Cheryl Burke, featuring Kim Johnson. You make me dance, break me up, break me down, play a sweet, make me move like a freak. Mr. Saxo Beat makes me dance, break me up, break me down, play the sweet, makes me move like a freak. Mr. Saxo Beat is sexy, boys and big, and be so shy, play with me. Salsa was definitely the highlight. I even got calls from my mom. Oh, really? Son, that's the way you're supposed to dance. <laughs> <laughs> we, we have advanced now to the semifinals and. Good job, by the way. That's pretty amazing. Yeah. So our first dance is the espionage Lindy Hop, which is, I've never seen dances mixed together like this before. They're trying to wear us completely out. Yeah. Lindy Hop, that means we're gonna be dancing for a minute and a half, uh -huh. flying around the floor. Correct. Oh my God. With goodness. lifts and everything. So I think the story that we should go for is, I'm the bad guy and you're the good guy. I'm trying to blow up the Mirabal trophy. Lindy Hop espionage is very cartoonish, which is really outside of Emmett's comfort zone. So when I tap you, you need to run like a cartoon character. Eight, one, two. He's really gonna have to sell this if he wants to do well. You have to bring on your acting skills. I don't have any. Yeah, you do. No, one, two. All this cartoonish stuff is not really my specialty. You're jumping funny. It's gonna be challenging, but the whole show has been challenging. You must put in the work in order to make it happen. Damn, that hurt. Dancing in espionage Lindy Hop. Emmett Smith and his partner Cheryl Burke. There's a man who leads a life of danger. To everyone he meets, he stays a stranger. Can hide me from my 